guys and welcome on board Queen Cat Airlines around Bahamas. Thank you for joining us today. Um, please leave a like and subscribe as a boarding pass to allow you on board the airline. And uh, yeah, let's get flying around the bah 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 Bahamas. We are currently at that airport right there. Oh, let me see the name. Our plane is right there, that little green dot. So um, yeah, let's get flying. I'm on developer mode, which is why... Is my landing gun on down? Oh, it is. Parking brake is on down. Obviously, I took a um, Cessna seaplane because, um, well, we're in the Bahamas, so of course we need a seaplane. Like, bro, come on. Who do you think you are, going to the Bahamas without a seaplane? <laughs> joke. What type of joke is that? That makes no sense. Take off, take off, take off, take off, take off. Oh, we're not gonna take off. Oh! Okay, we took off. Okay, we are now up in the air. In a seaplane flying around the Bahamas. Like, we do this every day or something. So, yeah. Mm. And that's good. And obviously, I got some facts for us. Woo! Trees, though. Hold on. I'm going to raise the flap so we can get some height in without losing any speed. Because Cessnas are kind of hard to fly sometimes because, you know, they're Cessnas, you need airspeed and stuff. So I just took up some flaps so they can get us up in the air. And, uh, yeah, the water is right there. That's really cool. I really want to go to the Bahamas, I want to go on a cruise ship, Royal Caribbean, so then we can go to their private island, and, uh, yeah, I really want to go on a cruise ship. Before I was scared of cruise ships, I don't know why, I think it's because, uh, I thought cruise ships can capsize, and I was like, oh no, the ship can capsize, I'm so scared, no, you know. And yeah, now, uh, I really want to go on a cruise ship. Looks like Vietnam, why does this remind me of, like, any Vietnam pictures, just the shadow, though. Right there in the shadow, oopsie, right there, shadow, warplane, and then, uh, or like, what's the, the spy plane, flying around Vietnam looking for enemies and stuff. What I just, um, so yeah, obviously I got some facts about the Bahamas, and, uh, let's get flying. So yeah, one of the facts is Mount Avaleron on Cat Island. It is actually um the it's the highest mountain in um it's the highest peak in the Bahamas and it is 63 meters long. Which to feet it is um 63 meters to feet is 206 feet high. So uh, yeah, that's kind of high. Let's land right here in the water. I am. I never landed a seaplane. It's my second time landing a seaplane. So, yeah. And uh, I crashed first time. So, time, uh, time to attempt landing a seaplane in the Bahamas again. There's some random thing right there. Also, um, there is under. There's an underwater cave system in the Bahamas. So, yeah, I, I really want to see that, too, but I don't know if you can, you, can you? It is, uh, 250 feet below, be, below the, um, below the, like, water level, so, that is really far down. Let's get landing. Ooh, time to land. Oh, 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 no. Ah, I'm not a seaplane pilot, okay? I don't know what I'm doing. I guess that works, right? Seaplaning. Well, what if you just stole the plane? But like, a good stole, not a bad type of stole. That makes sense. I mean, there we go, I guess. Oh, we did do it. There we go. Now we're making waves. Let's actually go to, uh, now. 
I really have no clue how to say that. How do you say that? Um, NASA, NASA, Na, Nalus, NAS, NASA, Narisha, something. I don't know. Let's take off. We're actually like on the island of NASA. This is it right here. But it's like we're on the other side. So let's let's go to the main area of NASA. And I forgot to use flap. This plane won't take off unless you get some flaps in it. Let's go and ooh oh 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 come on come on come on come on. Why am I screaming at a plane right now? Well, not screaming like come on into a plane right now. It makes no sense. So yeah, um, there's also a uh, Dean's Blue Hole, west of Clearance Tower on Long Island. There's Dean's Blue Hole, and it is 202 meters into the sea, which is 662 feet. And it is um, the deepest blue hole in the world. So it is here in the Caribbean. So yeah, that's cool. Oh no, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, ah, ah, ah we're gonna, we're losing airspeed. Ah, oh, breathe. Breathe, 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 breathe. Oh, that actually looks really nice. Look at this view. Breathe, we just gotta climb, we just gotta climb. Why did I pick this plane? Oh. It's going only 67 knots. That is like rotating speed. Come on, get it up, get it up, get it up. Yeah, we're good. This um this new seaplane um I do not I actually I, I am on the standard version so in case anyone is wondering are you on the uh, deluxe or the other one um actually if you didn't play Microsoft Flight Simulator in a long time but you have it you might remember the old planes obviously but now that it is available on uh, Xbox they kind of did like a celebration update and they added new Discovery flights which we will check that out. And they added new planes. So I am on the standard version, and this is one of the planes. Also, the Cub. The Cub also comes in a um, seaplane version like this, and a like uh, snow landing version. So you can land on snow and stuff. And it has some new liveries, like what's it called? There's a Xbox livery for that. I'm just playing a normal PC. Not on Xbox, because I don't got one to show. Over here is NASA. Noisa, Nicaea, NASA. NASA! Hey, let's go, NASA! It looks really beautiful. Let's see, can we get some altitude? Although I'll we'll have to use flaps because this plane won't let us um, go do the whatever you call it. I don't even know. I want to go on one of these islands right here. Linden Puldy International. That's a funny name. Flying over streets right now. Imagine living in the Bahamas. That'd be really nice. Imagine having a house on an island, like one of those islands right there. That would be so cool. This right here is a cool shot of my plane turning. Oh no, plane's dropping. We, I'm just kidding. The plane's not dropping. Let's attempt a landing here. Again. This, th this is my first ever um, ground landing on a uh, on the Cessna at uh, the water ground ground landing on a water plane i really want to go on a water plane in real life that would be really cool a seaplane maybe when i get my pilot's license i'll be able to maybe i'll buy a seaplane i really trust seaplanes because in the case of an emergency you got your wings obviously see i got wings they can glide me to a safe landing zone and we also got um, seaplanes, so in case. Okay, I'll check that out later. Um, 
that's kind of and um, there's seaplanes, so there's there's seaplanes, so they can land on the sea. So in case of an emergency and water landing required, you're all good. Just a typical landing. I mean, I'm pretty sure it won't be the best for landing somewhere in the bushes, but hey, come on, better than like not a seaplane and letting your plane drown. But that's just my opinion. There's a highway right here. Hey, how are you doing down there? Good. That's good to know. Plane takes off on runway. KLM and Pan Am crash. Boom. Oh. That would be so bad. Come on. Trying to get the buttery landing. We're down. And that was so smooth. What just happened? How did the screen turn like that? Okay, whatever. There we go. Welcome, uh, Bahamas, to it. Now, um, let's send out a drone so we can actually see, like, cooler parts of the ha Bahamas. See, look at this. This is nice. This is what NASA looks like. And I want to check something. Right here behind the airport, I have to get kind of low. Right behind the airport on the runway we landed on, I saw something that caught my eye, which maybe caught your eye, too. There is no... I'm confused. There's the airport we landed on, and you can see our plane with its lights on, right there. Right here, there is this body of water here, am I right? Yes, there is. And there is no way to get into the ocean. It's just a small lake right here. Which, well, maybe it's a big lake, but it's also a small lake, so... Would you rather, like, if you buy a yacht, you wouldn't put your yacht on a, on a lake, you would put your yacht in the ocean. So explain this. Bro, this dude basically wasted his money. Except if he maybe lives here. Then there's less piracy attacks. But still. I would keep my yacht in the ocean so I can sail to, let's say, America or something. This dude keeps it in a lake. I mean, sure, it's cool, runways right- Oh, probably this dude's a fan of planes, that's why- Right here. That's why he has a helicopter pad, I'm pretty sure. There's actually people on the deck, you can see. Maybe party going on. Arr, I am a pirate, so yeah. I don't know what- That happened. I just saw it in the corner of my eye when I was landing. Here's what the Bahamas look like from an uh, air view. That actually looks really nice. There's NASA and stuff. And here's the islands that connected. There's like the main part right there. There's where we landed. Here's another. You can actually go swimming with pigs in Bahamas. So yeah, that's kind of weird. It looks really nice. I really want to go here. I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of cruise ships right now. Some right here we could see them. Or maybe not, I don't know. So yeah, um, the reason I'm recording this quickly is because, one, I have to go packing because I'm going to this camp. There's a crashed plane at the camp, so I'm going to find that plane. I am determined to find that plane. When you guys are watching this, which this will be posted tomorrow, I'm making another F1 video today, Formula 1. And, um, yeah, there's a crash plane, I will find that plane, and, uh, right now, I am in my house, but by the time you guys are watching this, I'm sleeping in a tent, most likely, or doing something like that. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and, uh, go to the Bahamas, because it's nice.